Hi guys, so today we'll be talking about the trading bot. And um, I'll be working with the KuCoin trading bot, which is easy to use. And um, I kind of like the interface. So we'll be using the KuCoin trading bot. So if you don't have KuCoin, what you need to do is to download the KuCoin app on Google Play Store or any Play Store you have and install it on your device. Now, before we use a trading bot, we've got to understand what a trading bot is. A trading bot is simply a artificial intelligence um, interface that helps you to trade, saving you the time and then the emotional attachment that also comes with trading. So when the emotional attachment is removed, you are sure that the robot is going to trade and trade efficiently that is the word trade efficiently so the first thing we need to do before opening our trading boards is to find the coin or token we want to trade which coin or token we want to trade now if you open the trading board, which is here, if you click on it and it opens, the next thing you'll be seeing is an interface that says classic grid, DCA, future grid, smart balances. But what we want to make use of for this trading board is classic grid. That is where the action is happening. So once we click on the classic grid, it opens to us the the interface for the classic grid and guess what the number one person have made over 10,000 percent return on investment in less than 20 in less than 48 hours so you can see this figure here well i created my own trading trade grid this afternoon and guess what this is where i am not bad and um, the point you've got to look at one interesting hack I can I can show to beginners is that you can see all these guys here. Look at what they are trading. They are trading XHV. Every one of them is trading XHV. And so this might give you an insight on a coin to trade by clicking on it, going to search for XHV looking at the charts and looking at where your entry point will be yes you've got to know where your entry point will be so you are not buying it at a very high price you are looking where the market is reversing making reversal or when the market is about to pick up so that aside the next thing we want to do is to click on create because we are creating a grid we click on the create button and once we click on the create button it opens this interface and guess what we are working with the ai parameter aside the ai parameter we also have the customized parameter now let me quickly say that the difference between the artificial intelligence parameter and the customized parameter is that the artificial in intelligence parameter we select all the parameters for you automatically you can see it has selected the price range for me saying i'll be trading it will be trading for me between 4.3 dollar to 8 dollar which means that when luna falls to 4.3 dollar it will buy when it start going to five six seven dollar it will begin to sell gradually it will begin to sell gradually so as it is selling and making returns on investment and guess what it's going to place a hundred order on my behalf that means that it's going to be buying and selling till that number 100 is exhausted. The number, the 100 orders is ex exhausted. Now, I want you to also note that if the price range goes beyond $8, which is this, or below $4, it will not, it will stop trading automatically because it has gone beyond its range 
but as long as it falls within this dollar it will continue to buy and sell on your behalf until the hundred order is completed so that is that for the artificial intelligence but for someone who quite knows a little bit of what he's doing we have to come and click on the customize option because you want to have at least some control at the beginning and let the, uh, the, the, the bot do the rest. So once you click on the customize option, it brings this interface for you. So I'm trading, I will say I want to trade Luna, or maybe I don't want to trade Luna, so I'll click on this. I'll come here, I click on this, I say I want to trade XXP. This is it. So I click on XSP and it is there. So what I'll be telling the bot is, that, okay, I want my lowest price to be 1.8. I want my highest price to be 3.0. Now you can see that it is not as large as the um, option given to me in the AI. The AI option was quite wise, but I want my own to be tight so that it will complete the order on time hopefully and also maximize profit for me within a short period of time and guess what i can place between two to hundred order but i'll be saying just place 25 order i want it to be completed and guess what is telling me that i will make this amount of profit after the 25 grade is completed hopefully my profit range will be around that so if i make it guess what if i make it 100 100 it's still within that range but it gives me more more benefits if i'm if i'm trying to exhaust the 100 m um, order but i will not want to do that i just want to ensure that it completes this grid on time so you can do that change it to let's change it to 20. so as i change it to 20 my profit margin also goes up so i can now come and say okay how much do i want to invest i want to invest 40 dollars 40 dollars is the minimum and i come here and i click create so once you click on create it's going to create the 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 board for you but i'm not i'm not doing this because i already have a boat in action and guess what if you click on the classic grid this is me here, the last um, name appearing here. When you click on it, you will see that it has made 0.2% um, profit so far. And if I click on it, if I click here, if I click there, it's going to show me my other history. It's showing me that it bought Luna it bought Matic, I mean, sorry, it's Matic. It bought Matic around this price. And guess what? Look at the price it has been selling Matic for me over the period of time. It sold for me when the price rose to 1.2. It sold when it got to 1.4. Sorry. It sold when it got to 1.5. It sold when it got to 1.7. So you can see that it was make it was selling by matic gradually as the price was going up so it has been a good deal so far and it has made 33 my other history have been 33 and that's placed we are still have open order of 30 which is not bad so so far so good it has made money for me on my behalf why i was doing some other things i just said the bot and guess what it has been making money for me so this is what i want to show you but the first thing first is that you must look at the chart. If you look at the Matic chart here, if I click on the grid, this is where you can see your chart. Click on my name and I click on this. And so I'm supposed to click here. The current price, when I click there, when I click on the current price, it opens to me the chart of Matic in the past one day. So I can see that I entered around here. And guess what? It has been buying, it has been selling, it has been buying, it has been selling. And 
I have been in a profit. So for you guys out there, just take your time, look at it again, experiment with it, maybe with a couple of um, change you have in your account and see how it goes and give me your feedback. So how do you stop your boat? For example, you, 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 let's say you want to stop your boat. After some time, you, you, you realize um, some amount of profit and you want to stop the boat. You don't have to wait till it completes the whole transaction. Yeah, sometimes you just want to stop it. You want to take your money, maybe because you saw some other coin or token that is doing well and you want to go into that um, business or that investment or that trade. You click on your boat that is running and you can see the power button here. So once you click the power button, once you click the power button, it's going to ask you stop. So you can now click on confirm. And once you click on confirm, you are good to go. So I'm not stopping this, no way. So basically that is what you need to do. So let me have your feedback if you have any questions about it in the comment below or on the group chat. Thank you very much. Have a beautiful day.